What's going on YouTube, Fezify Media? Boy oh boy, the irony. So yesterday we covered the whole story of where the girl erupted on the bouncer, was making racist remarks, an absolute fool of herself, and it seems it runs in the family. Because in 2019, her mum punched a Worcester pub landlord on her daughter's 18th birthday. It said her mum attacked the pub landlord while she was out celebrating her daughter's 18th birthday. And also, we know it's her because of the same name as the grandmother as well, Mrs. Croft. She's age 43 of Woodhouse Close. Punched landlord Terry Clark on the Royal Exchange several times after he asked her to leave the premises. Very similar to what happened with her daughter. The court heard how Croft had been out on the evening with her daughter and around 7.15pm police were called to the pub following a report of a woman, the defendant, being restrained by an off-duty policeman. She had been in the pub and had six pints before leaving, only returning to the pub when a member of her party collapsed outside. It said the defendant and her daughter had left the pub before going back in. The victim asked them to leave and they both argued with him. The daughter went outside but the defendant tipped over a table. Clark had taken hold of her leg and he fell back at this point. She kicked out at Clark who grabbed her leg and pulled her towards the exit. And she got back on her feet and then he let go but started punching him in the face and chest a number of times. The defendant then grabbed his upper clothing causing the neckline to scratch and tear causing the teeth of the zip of his hoodie to come out and Croft was then hauled by Clark and a police sergeant Carter went over to speak to her. As she was still being abusive, she was arrested and taken to Worcester Police Station. She actually pleaded guilty to assault at the pub on November 28th. Chair of the bench, David, fined Croft £80 for the assault along with a victim surcharge of £32. Criminal damage amounted to £100, which was less than the prosecution valuation of the hoodie shirt she had ripped at £150. In total, she was ordered to pay £347 after cost of £135 was added. Now, numerous people have sent me this story saying it's the mother of that lady going viral in the bouncer clip and also the grandmother that recently spoke out about the situation of her granddaughter she shares the same name as this mother as well and also both articles describe them both as being from Worcester as well so it's the same family our next story guys a football player called Ryan Gonda also put up a clip where he was receiving race abuse as well another one has gone viral we've got a real problem in this country You've got to watch this clip to the end, guys. What did you call me? Greedy, no, what else did you call me? Greedy. No, what else did you call me? I called you greedy. No, you call me a, you call, you call me a black cunt, you little tramp. Yeah. Didn't you? Nice didn't you? Oh, you I didn't you? Yes, I did. You're a nigger. I'm a what? Nigger. I'm a what again? Nigger, 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 I'm a what? Wait, call me up one more time. Wait, you're a nigger. How much have you Please made today? Not much, that's why I'm calling you greedy. Alright, put it down and I'll put more in there for you. Um, How much you want? How much you want? I want somewhere to sleep. You want somewhere to sleep? Yeah. Well, you know when you call people niggas and be racist and all that? Yeah. yeah. They ain't gonna get you far in life, you Go know that, innit? Then, darling. I'm not asking you, am I? Well, I'm about to put five pounds in your thing, put it down, man. You ain't getting nothing, you little tramp. Yeah? The old me would have kicked you in your fucking head, you little skit. Yeah? Don't you dare ever call me a nigger, a nigger again. More and more people need to be exposed for behaviour like this because it gets normalised when people don't get punished and exposed for it. We know the court system can be light, but us as a community can pull together and expose people to behave like this and then we have a better and more respectable community. It's the most lowest of lows to call anyone anything because of their race. Guys, thank you all for watching this video. As always, make sure you subscribe and press that notification bell to be updated on my next videos and follow me on Instagram at Fezify. Drop me a message, feel free. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.